I'm not a vampire, not an alien, I'm not the fucking mummy, I'm a goblin. Greetings, Goblin Nation! Welcome to this review of the car, Road to Revenge. Well, it's actually not that, that long ago that this movie came out. I'm like, what? Seriously? This movie that, uh, it says, I have seen a movie like this before in 2000, uh, 2000s, 90s, I don't know. It was a uh, movie that while back, it was when you uh, could rental a movie a little bit easier, when you had those blockbusters kind of stores that you could just rental something. That was a lot of awesome times, you know? And uh, one of the, I could uh, like seven movies, and one of those sevens was with a car coming to life. But we actually never find out in that movie how the car come in life and how it's a kind of thing. I even don't remember the whole plot of it, but it kind of has made it like look like it was possessed by something. But we never know what what the hell was possessing it. Because then there were other cars that were kind of possessed. That was weird! But this one, we get a little bit more detail about how everything go on. It's about this girl and this man, but this man is a business woman, a man. Yeah, he gets a lot of money. It's kind of business. He bought so this cool new car and the AI and everything. Everything. Gets everything you want and more. Yes, more, I told you. So, because of uh, that kind of thing. And he wants his girl back. He wants the girl that yeah, kind of broke up with him. It's like, but that is because, you know, the invisible man kind of thing. You know, the plot of this, this guy that's very rich, very controllable. Uh, wants to control everything, wants to kind of do this, do that, say say what you eat, say what you can breathe, say what you kind of think. Those kind of things, you know, those. That's pretty much the same kind of thing that happened here. Uh, same same uh, road to kind of revenge that uh, he, he kind of was a slow builder kind of thing. And uh, uh, lots of, uh, I, I'm just, uh, you saw in that he was ranged and he didn't like it when he left. This guy eh, gives at least a second chance. He, uh, his girl a second chance. Like you know what? I did some wrong, but I know now that I know the type. You, I want you back. I want you back. Oh come on, be my darling, be my girl, be my girl. Come on, be my girl. So he's, she's like, uh, I like the e food. Was awesome, but no. So he doesn't. He does it. Uh, he uh, kind of takes it well. He's very pissed off, of course, but he doesn't do it what, like the invisible uh, woman kind of did. Uh, go psychopathic, had, had his old mask on, and this invisible thing. No, no, no! This guy didn't do anything vengeful. He just gonna go to his work, and he starts working and working. But uh, of course, he has this chip that has a lot of black things going on, uh, black data kind of thing of. This kind of happened, the blacklist and things, oh this uh, can, there is this whole corporation, this whole bad, bad, bad gangs, bad uh, mafia kind of thing happening. It's a cyber uh, punk kind of world, but very much like just beginning the cyberpunk kind of th theme going on. And uh, because of that, those people are gonna be, kind of, if they find it, so they're going to go to him. But they're a little bit too much psychopathic, the ones that go after the chip. They're so much psychopathic, like, yeah, come on, let's torture a little bit. He's still not telling it. Ah, let's torture a little bit more. He's not telling it. Ah, let's throw him uh, out of the window. It's like, what? I thought you needed him. But apparently, yeah, he's not going to tell it. Fla flies through the window right on his beautiful menu car. Bam, dead. All the blood over his car kind of thing. Next day. Uh, well, they kind of go back to the stripper or uh, stripper mall kind of thing. Uh, well, not stripper mall, but, uh, but to the strip club where everything goes on. Everybody is uh, is half naked or boobs kind of thing. Weird stuff going on. It's a uh, very much stripper maximum uh, carnage kind of thing. Maximum let's let's uh, go a lot kind of thing. And uh, one of the uh, kind of things like what did you do? The boss kind of kind of the boss needs kind of thing. And apparently the only only girl that knows about it is his ex-girlfriend so we need to know what kind of thing and uh, so while that's going on the car gets dragged away well then the car activates again and uh, because of that because of the activates again because of that 
Uh, well, the car becomes a big deal. I know. Uh, he wants to protect his girlfriend. That's the whole point. He wants to protect his girlfriend. He wants some vengeance on or, or while he's on the road, uh, killing every bad guy that uh, kind of came across. So in this uh, movie, then the girl kind of the, the girl has to uh, kind of stake sure she gets a little bit like uh, oh yeah kind of. Thing. She was also from this bad neighborhood, but she's not now. Because of the man, that's why she loved kind of thing. She loved it, but she also doesn't love it. And the night is kind of uh, now after them. So she is kind of running, running, running. Kind of uh, first, she's like, okay, need it. Then they expect her because then some people are starting to die. Lots of people start to die from the night. One kind of thing. Uh, one person starts to die. The second person starts to die. And then it's where, where they expect, like, maybe she did it. Maybe she is in the car. And because she was uh, also staying with a friend, not a friend kind of thing. Then the car comes to the safety, and killing them. So, <laughs> just going over it. <laughs> it was very cool to see. I love this seeing this car come. I am glad there is another movie like this because I feel like this is like something that don't um, not a lot of things do. And I really like it when uh, you get these possessed cars, things that like uh, like could become so much cooler. Uh, this one is certainly on the top of uh, my kind of thing, but let me first keep uh, keep recapping the movie. So, so he kind of uh, uh, he kind of drives around, killing some other bad guys that tries to kill some trying now. Now the knights kind of thing starts to get pissed off, you know, pissed off. He's like, oh, come on, this car kind of thing. Okay, for whoever fucking gets me the car, gets uh, whatever they want, some uh, booster things to make uh, become a little bit more cyborg, you got it. Kind of thing. Whatever you want, modification you want, I I'm gonna get it to you if you give me the car and the girl. So the girl teams up with the cop, but uh, as like. He is in, she is in weakness protection. Well, we find out the cops are a little bit corrupt too. So he, even though he trusted somebody, the cop is now in danger, and the girl is kind of get, getting arrested by the cops. And when she finds that out, it's like, oh no, I'm gonna be, I am gonna, I'm gonna be uh, captured by the cops. But of course, uh, eventually she is from the hood. She she is not uh, the richest guy. She sure she's now rich, but she still has her gun uh, already. And that's uh, what the cops didn't expect. Like shit, they go uh, laying on the ground. Well, the car is while that's going on. The car has killed uh, a lot of people. It's also also on this point. I forgot to tell. Like uh, this trip club, the the cop finds uh, finds out about this trip club. Uh, uh, well, no. Before that, I forgot to uh, comment. Before that, the car kind of uh, saw them having sex, you know? Those two are having sex. The cop and the girl were having sex when the witness protection kind of thing. He didn't like it. He got very, very jealous. Like, real jealous. So much jealous that he kind of... Uh, kind of goes nuts against the, uh, against the cop. So after the cop is kind of alone, he goes after the cop. The cop kind of almost gets killed, but just escapes in time. Then he goes uh, back after the other, and then the rest are kind of him. So the the rest is his vengeance, uh, kind of his revenge to all the people that hurt him. Uh, he's still jealous. He's a car that's jealous, apparently. And uh, then that thing with cops happened. The cops kind of uh, well, no, the, the second time. The second time he goes in the strip club. Yeah, okay, but oh, I forgot to one mention. I forgot to mention one thing. One little thing I forgot to mention before that strip. One, well, no, okay, let's let's go back. Sorry, man, I'm doing this from top of my head. Sometimes things click in a little bit late. Okay, okay, you got me. You feel me? You still can uh, move on what I'm saying. Okay, so after that cop thing kind of thing, he goes my car, gets over the thing. Uh, the car, the cops were on the ground. And the car drives to run while he's being chased by the rest of the, the night. And she goes in the car, goes the other way, and he's like, Your friend's like, She's not, that's not my friend, that's some, I don't know, insanity kind of guy. That's kind of like, okay, if that's true, uh, uh, we're gonna make a deal. So they make a deal. Bad idea to make deals, man, man criminals, but okay. So she kind of, kind of drives them in the corner, he follows, uh, yeah. 
There he falls in a pit. Everybody starts going like, there is nobody in. There is nobody in. You are lying to me. He's like, no, no, I was not lying. This was all kind of thing. The car is possessed, man. The car is possessed. Uh, they're like, fuck it. Uh, you're gonna, you're gonna be, you're gonna be maybe killed or turned. Apparently, she's gonna be turned. Anyway, so they try to destroy the car. Everything but it. Die, die. The car gets uh, gets destroyed, demolished, and then gets dragged somewhere else. Uh, when that gets dragged, somebody, an old man that says, Christ, look, my lucky day, this great car, that great car, beautiful car, yes, yeah, sure, it's messed up, but I can still work with it. So he starts working all night while the girl is getting uh, converted to become one of the night members all night. Till so she's like, okay, this guy failed me, the cop uh, kind of got released, the cop got uh, kind of thing. Uh, this, uh, this was the only co uh, corrupt cop that we really had. That I could do everything. So yeah, this cop is now failed us. So you can uh, kind of torture him. He can't betray you too. So uh, she's like, okay, fine. A little bit of fire, a little bit of this, and then she runs away. Fuck this bitch, I'm out. The kind of thing uh, against the the, uh, the leader from the night. So like inside, ah! <laughs> like kill her. <laughs> Kind of thing. Of course, on this point, she has uh, most of the kind of thing. The car destroys them, or she has killed one that was like very fire psychopathic kind of thing, pyro kind of maniac uh, that got burned by her own fire and then ran over, uh, uh, right over by the car. Uh, anyway, so she runs. She run. Uh, she kind of runs out. And and the night, the leader of the night come. The cop finds uh, finds him uh, um, too. I uh, find so also and when that happened when that all happens when the car kind of thing the car also drives in uh, before that in the strip club to try to get, do a second time going to but you know anyway so now now the co uh, the cop co uh, the cop is there and the knight is trying to kill him the leader of the knight is like everybody's dead but I'm still alive I'm gonna kill you and then it's like they try to fight him, but then see that behind them there is the the car coming. Like, she's like, "Good luck, bye." And I was like, "Huh?" Uh, uh, the car starts falling. He's like running, 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 and then he gets right over. Uh, well, through the window, kind of thing, and a piece of him because the glass scratched him so much that his whole inside, the uh, underside, is well away, and his inside gets in the car. And uh, now there is only them. Now the, there is only those two. You would think, okay, it's over. She, he has his vengeance. We're all happy ever after, right? Wrong. You're totally wrong. This car is jealous as fuck, and because of his, his jealousy, he was so jealousy, 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 that he, I kind of want to kill the cop still. Um, then it's like, okay, we got dynamite. We got this dynamite. We uh, we trick him. It's like, you want me? Yeah. This is never gonna happen, James. I know you're you're the one that possessed the car, kind of thing. But you should move on, kind of thing. You how you think this is gonna end? How you think it's gonna end? You me, kind of thing. But you're dead. You're dead. How is this gonna end? You're dead, man. You're just a shadow for my former self. Your car right now. This doesn't make any sense that you would be able to do it. But the uh, car, kind of thing, is like nope. I, if I'm not gonna get you, nobody is. And he d uh, dri drives. But because he drives right into a track, so his wheel is up and he cannot move till the uh, whole explosion. And everybody's happy. She is on a broken and it's like, okay, wants to have a date with this cop. Well, even that explosion didn't stop uh, the car. So first, he kind of got uh, destroyed by the night, Not then recreated by a garage kind of thing. Now he is back from an explosion and. And somehow that's not hot. I mean, all is in fire, and the car seems like it could have been better days, like really messed up. But uh, it's like just in time, gets gets her the girl in, and then it's from Brooklyn. It's like, oh fuck, where do you think this is gonna go? And he is like, uh, he's just driving. He's gonna drive off a cliff. If it's like, if you, I cannot be with you alive, I can. We can be together in death. That's pretty much it. gone. So she's trying. To, ah! Uh, trying to get the CPU out, maybe that's what maybe that's kind of thing like everything out enough that uh, the car will not work anymore and that uh, the, uh, he cannot control the car anymore. So, just in time uh, before they fall off the cliff, she's like, Oh my god, that was a second 
a more analyzed that with this car. I mean, kind of can drive in water, and I don't think it's that deep, but still. Oh my god, so she just then is like, I'm gonna see that this car doesn't know, uh, push it off the off the cliff, like, you go alone, you go alone, and it goes alone, and that's uh, everything, she uh, just walks away now, kind of thing, but then, end credit kind of thing, uh, horror movies always need to be having that end thing that make it uh, look like there could be another car, uh, another movie, and the car slides go back on, <clears throat> underwater. Like a like a nightmare. Uh, uh, no, uh, Friday the Thirteenth, but with a car. It's gonna come back for kind of thing. Now pissed off that he didn't get girl kind of thing. Anyway, so what did I think of this movie? I feel like it's a nine out of ten. Uh, it's on there on the scale of uh, uh, the dark, uh, dark no black side and the. The, the revenge of the thing but the difference between those movies like there are some complaints i got with uh, those movies like the budget was too low for uh for that sort of kind of thing i feel the uh, color better the song that is a heavy metal kind of thing and i feel that the title didn't make uh, that much sense but this one this made more sense on all the way and i like movies like this i really enjoyed this movie with the car kind of thing they don't do that that often but, and it also felt a bit like the invisible woman kind of thing, but then on a bigger scale because you know we got uh, more people involved with this. Uh, I really enjoyed it. It was a very much enjoyable uh, to watch. And yeah, nine out of ten. What's your thoughts about this? Have you seen it? It's not that long ago that this came out, and I'm glad it came out. It was really interesting, really, really amazing movie uh, to watch. I'm glad it's in my life. I'm glad I got to able to see this. This is like one of those horrors. I'm like, okay, I'm on it. I'm, I'm sticking with horrors now. Anyway, what are your thoughts? Let me all know down below. Hope, hopefully, hopefully, with the love of God, I explained it well enough that you have followed the recap that I did uh, understand. Because sometimes I went back like, oh shit, I forgot this little thing. I'm sorry. Sometimes it happens. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to see you guys. And then the days got worse and worse and now you see I've gone completely out of my mind.